those of you who are on Facebook, you'll have seen uh, the message I'm putting up from uh, a friend of mine called Alex, who's um, had an obsession with killing half of Knowles' Safari Park, because um, he's on a shred diet, and obviously you're allowed high protein to get the meat in there, and he's gone a bit extreme with it. So what we have is a meat feast. Everything from camel, water buffalo, kangaroo, wildebeest, everything that you're probably not meant to kill, including crocodile. And this is how nerdy, this, this, this is how you get successful with macros. Even the macro counted on the back. Boomtown. Meat feast. What have we got here? What's this one? Cow. No, that one. We've been cow. What have we got? Zebra. So, for info on zebra, the macro balance per 100, 28 protein, 6 fat. Get yourself some zebra. We're going to be feeding down these and telling you what they taste like. That'll do. Crocodile. Sound. Water buffalo. Oh, it it? It's me. Kangaroo. Camel. Python. Look at that. That's weird. Zebra. I can't believe we killed a zebra. That's pretty bad. Gazelle. Horse. Courtesy of Tesco. Cow. Everyone knows that one. And wildebeest. And shredding. Safety glass. Using Budweiser. Gonna do a video about alcohol and shredding later on, but until then. <laughs> <laughs> What's this one? About to cook some bison. Bloody hell. That's like, it's probably, it's like knuckle. You wanna hold it? Everybody, welcome to the world to Alex and Tiz, hosts for the evening. Both currently on their start of their shred, hence the Excitement over mountains of meat. What's that on it? Olive oil. Olive oil. Just cooked in olive oil. This is just a classic barbecue mode, yeah. men staring at meat. Yeah, we're here. Small town about it. Yeah. 100 grams wildebeest burger going in a. It's crazy all the stuff out here. Look at this. What is this? Per muffin card 27. Figure. Put it in a white muffin with. So you can see them. So low fat. This is the beast. The burger. No ketchup, no seasoning. Let's just see what it tastes like. Mm. Really thick. Really lean. Really meaty taste to it. But not grainy at all like our beef. Chicken. What is that? Chicken wrap bacon? Guinea fowl. Guinea fowl? Chicken. <laughs> but we might have gone one, one non zoo animal. <laughs> So that's guinea fowl and bacon. So essentials for shredding, scales, food, uneaten food by the people that I'm now going to eat. This is all bison. Officially eaten quarter of a kilo of bison. And for the slaughter, what is it? What is it now? Horse. 
we have probably something that fell down at the Grand National. Macros for horses. Ah, 175 calories per hundred. Macros, 2806. Roasted. And that is on my fitness pal. <coughs> Is that medium? Yeah. Totally out of bounds. What do we think? Absolutely delicious. Description? <laughs> Does it taste like Tesco's lasagna? <laughs> Horse meat. Test one. It's pretty great. And it's when you're playing them. We play them. Texture of lamb. Oh, well, can I have a bit? Taste of steak. Is that what steak tastes like? Really good. So, very good horse meat. Got rare. Tastes good. Tastes like a sirloin. Put it to a medium. Ends up tasting a bit like uh, fillet. It basically tastes like steak. Uh, but nice food. Give it a go. Stick it in the burger. Next in line for the fryer, python meat. Look at that, that's really... Almost looks a little bit like fish. Best way of describing it, feels... Bloody hell, that's thick. Doesn't feel like fish. And we're just griddling it. So simply just seasoning it with some salt, griddling it with a brush of olive oil on the pan, stop it sticking on a very high heat. See how that one turns out. It is folding up and twisting. Oh, look at it go! Oh, it's like it's alive. That is weird. That, that is almost, that's oh, almost that's alien. Have you turned the other one? It's thick as it's not, it's not doing it quite as much. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I see where the scales were. Right, so, Python. We've decided it tastes like calamari octopus. You can see it's pretty tough to cook, pretty thick, pretty meaty. Texture of chicken, but a little bit tougher, that like chewier. And you can see the sections of the muscle. Really good though. We reckon it tastes like calamari. Oh, is this a good thing? Yep. You can see, that's in white meat. A little bit. A little bit. Okay, so python. Texture of chicken, taste of calamari. Inoffensive. Probably good with uh, yeah. salads. Yeah. I reckon that'd be good with a bit of Cajun seasoning on it. <laughs> or a bit of Cajun seasoning. Black and python. <laughs> Black and pie in case you season the guest safe keys. So uh, python we're putting so far in the order of rankings we've got bison, then horse, then python. Yeah. Everyone in agreement? Yep. Sorry.